unfold your potential for greater success in the market with the Smart Print Shop. So welcome to Heidelberg. My name is Paul Thompson. Today, smart is an essential part of our lives. Just take the smartphone or the smart home. You wouldn't want to give either of them away. Everything is networked and automated. Now this is also the case with the 2020 generation of Speedmaster, the most intelligent Speedmaster ever. It is simply smart. It provides answers to the important questions in packaging printing. How do I handle increasingly complex jobs in the shortest possible time? And how do I relieve the operator of the routine tasks? And finally, how can I permanently increase the effectiveness of print production? The so-called OEE. Now, Kirsten, what exactly is OEE? We have specifically evaluated the data from 460 Speedmaster presses worldwide in packaging printing. Each press is a blue dot. The machines can all achieve similar printing speed, but the OEE achieved is still very different. The question is, what is the OEE? It is the overall equipment effectiveness. It is an important key performance indicator for assessing how effectively a production system is and how effectively it is operated. It is made up of the factors of availability, performance and quality. 100% OEE is a theoretical value. Of course, this does not happen in practice. Our evaluations have shown that a Speedmaster XL106 is now operated with an average OEE of 27%. So there is still plenty of potential for improvement. The realistic performance limit today is approximately 70%. Innovative technology that reduces make-ready times, such as high-color multi-drive or autoplate XL, improves the OEE. But technology is only one part of the solution. It is even more important to improve processes and automate routine work. This is particularly true for packaging printing because of complex jobs with constantly changing spot colors and various board types. Thank you, Kirsten. And it is precisely this potential that we are exploiting with the new 2020 Speedmaster generation. Here at the Speedmaster control station, as much information as possible must be available automatically. So the substrate, the color and much more. The same naturally applies to the other machines in the process, such as the die cutter or the folder gluer. It all starts in pre-press, so please join me on a tour of our Prenect workflow. Prenect production has received customer approval for the jobs. Since Prenect supplies all the necessary data for the press, we also take care of color management. Here we see the calculation of the ink zone presetting. To exploit the full potential of the press, Prenect production calculates the ideal job sequence and sends it to the press. It's not just a pre-press workflow, but a solution along the entire production process. The connected CTP system processes the plates in the optimum sequence so that they can be used directly on the presses. However, the Prenect production workflow is not a one-way street. Data is made available to production and conversely, data is recorded to make strengths and weaknesses transparent. But let's see if the printing plates are ready on the Supersetter 106. Hi, Christoph. Hi, Paula. So the data has arrived from the Prenect workflow at the new Speedmaster XL106 control station, and all the information is now available. So this new Speedmaster generation offers a completely new way of operation, the Heidelberg user experience. Our presses guide and navigate the printer through the individual work steps and not the other way around. Telestart, which is included in every Speedmaster and determines all the necessary job changeover activities fully automatically. And that's for up to 50 jobs in advance. The production of this pharmaceutical folding box will soon be over. And after which we will then switch to a cosmetic carton. But since the job changeover only takes about three minutes, we need to speed things along a little bit, Christoph. But what are we seeing now on the wall screen? Yeah. Here we go, so the job change begins already. Let's take a first look on the IntelliGuide. And you see the progress bar underneath the machine schedule. And what we see here is the job sequence and the duration. It's clearly structured to operator, machine, autoplate and multi-drive. What we're doing now is an ink change in unit number one. 
During the same time, we changed the printing plates and washed the blankets. And yeah. after that, we fully automatic changed the coating plate. Okay, so that's what high color multi-drive stands for. The intelligent inking unit drive makes the inking unit independent, but always remains in connection with the machine's gears. Now, this means that the inking unit can be shut down while production is in progress, or the inking unit can be washed parallel to the blanket and also the impression cylinders. But incidentally, the new Speedmaster XL106 can also wash the impression cylinder of the coating unit fully automatically. An Autoplate XL3 makes it complete. The separate drive of the plate cylinder enables plate changing parallel to washing. And all this is done in three minutes? Yes, absolutely, in three minutes. After that, the press goes to the production automatically and ink press control starts to control ink and register. And because this happens very quickly, the printer has the Intelli run, mm -hmm. which changes all the views from the press center and the wall screen automatically. I don't have to worry about this. This is full automatic. Okay, so this works in the same way as a navigation in a car. It is, yeah. Okay, then I'll leave you to the job change and I'll have a closer look at Intelli uh, line. Yeah, okay, see you. With the tele line, you can see at a glance from the outside what's going on on the machine. An LED display is integrated into the printing unit. Blue signals, as it just was, that it was in production. And green means that an automatic make-ready process is in progress. And the yellow light shows the operator where he must now intervene. So I'm now back at the press center. How are we getting on with our make-ready, Christoph? Yeah, it's just a few seconds left. Okay. Then the machine will start again automatically. You see the screen already switched over to the impress control mode. Mm -hmm. And uh, when the Intelli guide is finished now, the Intelli run will also switch the screen of the wall screen. And then we see the impress control, the inspection control, and all this at one time, full automatically. So it really is an automatic make ready. It is, yeah. Thank you, great job. Sure. Colored changes play a major role, especially in packaging printing. Special color make brands unmistakable, but also lead to more wash-ups when changing jobs. We used this printing unit at a previous job. We don't need it now, therefore I can do the wash-up during my actual production and prepare this unit for the upcoming job. It's a perfect time to wash the ink rollers, including the ink duct. This saves time during the job change and assists me at the same time. And the wash assist determines the degree of soiling, for example, on the basis of the ink coverage or the print run and selects the optimum wash program. Now this simultaneously saves washing time and detergent and therefore money and resources. Press control is the only inline system that controls register and color from the start based on LAB and not just on sometimes misleading density measurements. It not only ensures incredibly fast setup but also stable control during production and all measured data is available afterwards as proof of quality. As inking and dampening go hand in hand, Christoph, how does that link to High Color Pro? Yeah, Paul. Non-optimized inking and dampening unit settings are one of the main reasons for quality problems and have been since the beginning of offset printing. High Color Pro enables the amount of dampening solution to be dosed independently on the operator side and the drive side while the press is running directly here from the press center. I can check my results immediately at the delivery. Excuse me. Take a look. Smart is also the new intelligent waste management system. The focus is on inspection control three for detecting even the smallest defects. And all the information required for this has already been transferred to the press via Prenex workflow with the job data. We now show the inspection by having placed previously marked sheets into the feeder pile. But Christoph, what will we actually see? inspection control detects the errors in printing and displays them on the wall screen. You see here now the errors. Okay. With the new device assist, 
I have defined in advance what happens when an error is detected. A good sheet or a PDF can serve as a reference. I can store up to 10 profiles depending on the type of error. For example, a strip is inserted in the stack, an acoustic or optical signal is activated, or the sheets are immediately ejected completely with the waste sheet ejector. So the link to inspection control is only one example. The device assist is a new step towards smart waste management and quality control. Efficient waste management is all about separating the unsaleable from the saleable sheets. When supplemented with CodeStar, an inkjet system prints a unique sheet ID. This enables the detected errors to be clearly assigned to the individual printed sheets. Christoph, hi, how are you getting hey, on? Yeah, the production is finished. Okay, great. Can I have a sample sheet of the uh, pharmaceutical car? Sure. Here you are. Super, looks great. Thanks very much for your help. Hello, Kirsten. Hi, Paul. As I see, the job is finished. Yep. We all know that the OEE is availability, quality, and performance. And to optimize the OEE, we need to know where we stand and where we start from. And for that, we need long-term analysis of the production data. We can provide this with Prenect Smart BI. Like for example here, you can see an overview of the production data. So it really is a sum of many parts coming together that will give us that OEE really, and, and we can analyze that and give us a full detailed breakdown of it. Exactly, what full transparency and knowledge where we stand in the process. It's perfect. So the print job has now been completed and is ready for further processing on the Masterworks Power Matrix 106 CSB and then onto the Diana Folder Gluer with Braille and inline inspection. And we would like to invite you to follow this path of the printed sheet to the finished box with us. So thank you for your attention and we look forward to seeing you in Heidelberg. Thank you. Thank you, Kirsten. Thank you, Paul.